speech that you gave on the House floor, I mean, it clearly altered the course of the whole debate. And I wondered what prompted you to get up there and, and say the words that you did. I mean, had you planned it beforehand? Did you know what you were going to say? Obviously, the emotion was so in the moment. Anderson, I had not planned to go to the well, as we call it. Um, we had been there all day, and, and quite frankly, all of us were exhausted. At one point, someone said, and I don't know who it was, but someone made a glib comment or something that made me just angry. I was so angry that they were making light of such a serious issue. And no one at, to that point had said anything about the nine lives lost in Charleston, South Carolina. And being a member of the Charleston delegation, I, I had to get up and I had to try to refocus the debate where it needed to be. And I'll tell you, I have to say it, I, I, I can't, this impact on South Carolina is, 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 will go on for generations. We have now dropped the NCAA boycott. I am so proud of South Carolina. I'm a lifelong South Carolinian, and I cannot tell you just the absolute pride that I have in my state.